Hi everyone, I decided to grab my phone and show you this recipe I'm about to make because I've been making the best different kind of meals lately and I always forget to tell you or film them or anything like that because it's just a big deal to do it. But today I thought I would show you something kind of French, kind of interesting that we ate recently at a restaurant. It's called Blackened Brie and uh, let me show you what I've got going here. Okay, I've got my wheel of brie and I'm gonna have to wet it, and then I'm going to roll it in this Cajun seasoning, and then you fry it in a frying pan, and then you put it on this baking sheet, and you put it in the oven on 400. I'll give you the um, times and everything and the amounts in a minute. Of course, I'm gonna open a new bottle of white French wine, my favorite. Now, it calls for chutney on the side. I don't have any chutney, but what I'm gonna do is use some peach mango fruit spread. I'm gonna put it in with these raisins and let it sit a while so the raisins will plump up a little bit. And that's gonna kind of be our side. And I'm also gonna slice up an apple to go with it. We don't have any French bread either. So we're gonna use, I'm gonna use gluten-free crackers and Scott's gonna use his kind of crackers. So, uh, let me get going on this. Okay, I've got my wine most importantly, cheers. Scott's my cameraman. Okay, zoom in down here. All right. We don't really know if this is going to work, but you're supposed to wet the brie, and we're in discussions on whether you're supposed to peel it or not. It didn't say peel it. And the Scott said the one in the restaurant wasn't peeled, but I don't remember that well. And I'm supposed to coat it with this Cajun seasoning. That's not enough. All right. And then when you, you're, we're going to fry it in butter. Do you remember how long, honey? 20 seconds each side. Okay. <laughs> I probably need some more. So you get the idea. We'll turn off the video and then come back in a second. All right, we've got the butter hot. And uh, 1001. <laughs> Alexa. Set the timer for 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Okay, we're, we're doing it for 20 seconds. Then we're going to put another pat of butter on and 20 more. We don't have an iron skillet, but we think this will be okay. Now let it, yeah. Okay. We're heating the next. Alexa, stop. We're heating the other butter. I guess the skillet is hot enough. Flip it and put it on. Alexa, set the timer for 20 seconds. 20 seconds. This looks pretty good. It's looking like the restaurant. It's blackening. You know what? Should I pick it up though and yeah. do the sides? Okay, I think we need to blacken the sides. So we're doing that. Oh, it looks really good. I think we better turn it off. All right. And now we're going to put it into a 400 degree oven for how long? Six minutes. Ah! We're not used to this electric skillet. Six minutes? All right. Alexa, set the time. Okay, it's kind of oozing out. Ooh. It's kind of. I don't know if this Maybe is going to work. Flip it over. That'll work. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Here it is. We were going we're going to put some crackers around it. We've got our apples, we've got our fake chutney. And uh, we're fixing to have a feast. So we'll show you the presentation when okay, we're Okay, I just remembered we have these toasty things that we buy in Paris. I think this is the last of them, but they are so yummy. They will be perfect with the brie. The the apples and the chutney and our wine and we are happy campers this is our dinner here we go hey we're over here on the coffee table of course watching tv so we're going to try this and we'll let you know how it was when we finish and i just want to say that tonight is the night that i uploaded my video about my new book and um i'm really nervous so i needed some really good food and a little bit of wine <laughs> Because it's been a long day between Instagram and the website and Facebook and YouTube and the magazine and 
Oh my gosh, it's been a lot of stress. So I'm looking forward to sharing this beautiful meal with my husband, right, Scott? Yeah. <laughs> he didn't want to be in the video, so he's leaning back. He doesn't know it's pointing at me right now. <laughs> he's in his pajamas. Well, sort of. Bye. Okay, the verdict is it was very, very good. Uh, we really enjoyed it, and uh, we'll definitely make it again. So I hope you enjoyed this little peek into a uh, very impromptu French dinner. Bye.